Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna look at Klein from Anthony Stan. Uh, what is Klein? Basically, it is a color change gimmick or a color change method. It's a way for you to change one card completely into another, whether it be the front or the back. Uh, he's gonna give you seven different uh, tricks using this single method, and it's pretty cool, it's pretty ingenious. Uh, you wanna see what it looks like, this is it. All right, so that was Klein from Anthony Stan. You might remember uh, I did the review for his other trick, the 1 2.0. Both of these tricks uh, were produced by Magic Smile Productions. Okay, so a couple questions we always ask about all of our Magic reviews, and the first of which is, what's in the box? What's in the box? Uh, you're gonna get a gimmick, kind of, <laughs> and you're gonna get a download code so that you can watch the video online. Is it what I thought? Yes and no. Uh, it's not what I thought initially because when I watched the trailer, I was really hoping for something out of the ordinary, like out of the box. Like I was kind of hoping for something like science fiction-y when they said that there was a gimmick and you watch the trailer and it looks really magical. And so I was really hoping for something that was kind of like crazy. But after receiving the gimmick and watching the video, it was more like, oh, then I guess it's exactly what I thought because it's exactly what would seem to be the most logical explanation. So there you go. How are the angles? The angles are covered completely uh, by your hand or a card, uh, and it's meant as a straight on color change. So this is not good from the sides or from the back. Can it be inspected? Anthony does a great job teaching you how to do cleanup so that you can get rid of the gimmick, okay? trying to be as vague as possible, but there is a way that you can do it so that you can hand the deck out and there's no dirtiness, okay? What's the overall quality and production value of the video? Uh, the video is available in both English and French subtitles, so all the teaching is done with text on screen. I personally watch the entire thing with the sound off because otherwise it's just music going over and over again. You do get multiple shots, uh, you do get a lot of great angles. Uh, you do get uh, both stationary and following camera, which is great. You get lots of very creative um, backgrounds and environments. It's not shot in HD, uh, but you know, that's okay. And like I said, there's no words or patter or help when you watch these tricks being performed. You're just simply watching a performer do a magic trick 
without any words or pattern on top of that. So that was kind of a little disconcerting. Is it well made? You make it uh, for the most part. Uh, it's, it's a lot of, it's arts and crafts, but it's not difficult arts and crafts. In fact, it really couldn't be any easier. Is it well taught? Uh, there's quite a few tricks on this. Once you learn the basic principle, uh, Anthony does teach you several variations, several different ways you can apply this. Uh, the two card transposition is very good. Probably my favorite trick on the video. Um, the under the cellophane trick, uh, where the card magically appears under the cellophane of a deck, that was good too. It was a little hard to follow though without English patter. The uh, first time through watching it, I was like, what just happened? And I had to rewind and watch the whole thing again. Um, there's another trick on there that's uh, a photo trick that he does with a cell phone. That one for me was impossible for me to figure out what was going on. Without hearing people talk, uh, without knowing the story or the plot or what's supposed to be taking place, I understand watching the, the cards change from one to the next, but I just wish that there had been some story included so that I could understand how this was being presented. You know, it's difficult to watch a trick without any words. So it was kind of like watching pantomime. There was one other trick uh, with a, a jumping ink effect where a cross jumps from uh, a, a random card to the selected card to your hand. That one was pretty good too. How much practice does it require? Uh, you're gonna learn the entire effect and how to make the gimmick within the first four minutes of the video. Now the video is 50 minutes long, and it's mostly Anthony just teaching you variations and different ideas. But for the most part, uh, you're gonna learn everything and be able to do this within the first four minutes. How much setup and reset is there to this? Um, here's where it was a little bit of a, a thing for me. Uh, getting the gimmick into the get ready position is kind of awkward. Now Anthony does it very smoothly in the video, but even for him, it, it takes a little longer than the actual amount of time it would normally take for you to do the moves that he's doing without a gimmick. Does that make sense? So the movement for me at the beginning, getting this gimmick into place, it felt awkward, it felt awkward to watch, it feels awkward to perform. And so even for Anthony, who's supposed to be the expert at this, there were moments where you can even see him you know, sliding or getting things ready or putting things in place. And it's not just a fluid, like pull the card out, put the card back in. It's kind of like a, you're doing this little get ready and it's noticeable. So I didn't love the setup part. Positives, what are the positives for Klein? Positives are, this is a very magical looking color change because the performer doesn't even appear to touch the cards. And I can see this technique used for many different applications. Negatives, all right, so what are the negatives? Like we say around here, there's negatives to everything. These are just the negatives that I see. They don't have to be the negatives that you see. Um, like I said, the get ready uh, for Klein is very knacky, okay? It's very knacky and in order for the deck to be examinable, you're gonna have to do some cleanup. You're gonna have to be comfortable um, doing a little secret move, okay? But it's easier because of the gimmick, but I'm just saying to get in and get out of this, it's a little dirty, all right? Is it worth your money? It's 20 bucks, 20 bucks depending on whether you choose to build the gimmick or not. I believe this is still available as a video download only. And uh, if it is, if you are able to find this as a video download, I would suggest you do it that way and build the gimmick yourself because the gimmick is extremely easy to build. You can build it right now with things that you have at home. Who would like this? I think people who would like um, a very visual color change, something that uh, you know see other people doing, uh, I think would like this. People that would just like to learn a new color change that's you know affordable. Uh, people that do street magic, people that do walk around, or even somebody that just likes things you know, flashy and different, I think would definitely enjoy Klein from Anthony Stan. All right, so that is my review for Klein from Magic Smile Productions and Anthony Stan. I'd like to thank Murphy's Magic for providing this for me so that I could review it for you. And if you'd like to purchase your own, you can find it at your favorite Murphy's Magic dealer. Thanks, bye.